FTV ESA, um, nil nil. Not the greatest game in the world, but in times gone by, could quite easily have lost that as well. Yeah, you know, like when the ball went over, well, nearly went over the line, I was thinking, ah, oh, here we go. But do you know what? Like we started off all right. We we seemed to be playing from the wings. We seemed to have width, and then from then on, it just became stale and slow and stodgy and like. You know, on the positive, I think Mustafi had a great game, but on the negative, like, Leno made some good stops, but he's so slow with yeah, the transitions the, and that were a yeah, couple we, times. We were all saying that great. he doesn't move the ball. He seems to move the ball very slowly very in the slow. transition, which then invited them onto us. And it's one thing when it's, you know, it's a goal kick or you've got the ball at feet, but when you've caught the ball and you can see there's a break on, get going, and he's just taking his time. And like, I think that's one area of his game where maybe Martinez is a better option. His distribution is mm. much better. He's a lot more cocky and confident with it and there were just so many times in this game where you're looking at it and you're thinking are we like at the point where we're coming away to Burnley and paying for a draw that's how it felt mm. like you know I'm not I'm definitely not getting on Arteta's back at all at this point but you look at him and you just think is he a bit cautious you know take a long time to make all his substitutions and mm. a, lot of, a lot of it didn't make sense yeah, it's a rebuilding process for him is it? it's going to take time to to get the team to where he wants um what, but so far, would you say he started off all right? Yeah, he's done a good job. You know, like you said, he's, 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 these are not his players. That he's been left with a big mm. mess, and he's already made huge strides. He's turned Shaq around. He's got Urzel chasing and harrying and hustling. Um, and you know what? We kept. I know this might not sound all that, but we kept Aubameyang in this window. And I think the the, the equation is very very clear. Mm. Win the Europa League will sign his new contract and he stays. If, he, if we don't get to the Champions League and he leaves, no fans can hold it against Pierre-Emerick Aubameyang because from the day he came to this club, he's done what he's supposed to do, which is score. And off the pitch as well, he's had a positive impact. You can see he's played like a big brother role to the Sackers and the Martinelli's. And I don't want to see any fans getting on his case. I don't want to see any fans, you know, we, it's, it's responsibility of the club, the other players now, to step up, win the Europa League because obviously I think the league's done and that's the only way into the Champions League. If not, we could face another five years of this mediocrity. And, you know, you're not really blaming Arteta, you're blaming the owners. I don't know.